Yellowstone supervolcano, Old Faithful geyser eruption we'll see today from the live cam that they have. We're at the upper geyser basin and we're going to see geyser steaming at the walkways where visitors are walking along. And you're going to see that this it's steaming right under their feet. And uh, that usually doesn't happen, but I don't know, something, it looks like something is adjusting or has changed because of yesterday's pork chop geyser eruption. We had a 3.2 and an hour and a half later a 2.5 at uh, the northwest section of Norris Geyser Basin and pork chop erupted. And uh, I don't know if that has anything to do with the steaming along the walkways. Of course, this is the upper geyser basin and Old Faithful. This is not Norris Geyser Basin, but still the hydrothermals could be connected. Yesterday, June 28th, is the day that Pork Chop Geyser erupted once again. Kindly support my Patreon account since YouTube has again demonetized my YouTube channel. The daily posts are five videos daily and they are totally different from what I have on my YouTube channel. Thank you so much for your support and that you find all my content so interesting. You'll find the Patreon account details in the description box below. This is the uh, footage from the live cam and I'll leave a link below for you for this. Look at that. That's right on the walkways where the visitors and the tourists are walking along. And as you can see, that's the geyser that uh, is, I've never seen that that close to visitors actually. Uh, and you can see other ones in the forefront close to us where those lines of first trees are. That's smoking there as well, but that's not on the walkway. Um, now the thing is that a lot of these geysers of course have uh, all types of volcanic gases coming out as well and it's not that uh, good for us to be breathing all this stuff. Um, it could be, some of it could be acidic, but anyway, uh, I guess they had fun going through this steam that was so close to the walkways. Uh, I'll let you go and uh, look at it. There's a lot of steam coming out in various sections. The footage the camera is zooming in so the footage as you can see is not at all good but what I noticed was those line of dead trees you see those whitish branches there on the, the I didn't notice that they had that many dead trees in that area now the white that you see on the ground that's that's you can see more coming out there and there in the foreground but the white that you see is not snow that's actually the minerals that are deposited from the steaming of the various geysers from this area of the Norris Geyser Basin. Basin, So that's not snow, that's actually the residue from the chemicals and the minerals that come out from these geysers. And uh, I remember an old video that I made, one of the uh, Caldera Chronicles told us that the, in, in thousands of years, or hundreds of thousands of years, these minerals, you know what they're going to turn into? they're going to turn into opals. A lot of these geysers uh, have those beautiful colors that we see, the prismatic and all that, you know, the, uh, the prismatic pools with all those beautiful blue and orange and yellow and uh, green colors. They, all those minerals will turn into opals thousands of years from now. So you can imagine uh, all the chemicals once they are encrusted and are hardened, they will become semi-precious stones. I just personally love opals anyway. <laughs> They're so beautiful and iridescent, the colors that they have. Um, so I'll just let you watch this. A lot of visitors there today, June uh, 29th. Beautiful weather. It's just that this uh, footage is just terrible, but uh, it clears up very nicely when we see the Old Faithful Geyser eruption in a few minutes.
Okay, the camera has now switched to Old Faithful, which is about to erupt. That steam that you see there is the beginning of Old Faithful's eruption.
So this is uh, the end of uh, the eruption of Old Faithful. And I guess, again, you can see that there are most of the times where, I don't know, something is going wrong with the camera. It's not its best day today. Thank you for your support. Please leave your comments. Thank you.